The African landscape is increasingly hot and hostile for millions of smallholder farmers who depend on a successful maize harvest. For almost 20 years, Simit, working in Mexico and with a team of partners in eastern and southern Africa, has spearheaded an ambitious, pro-poor program to develop maize that address the most pressing constraints farmers themselves identified. Drought and low soil fertility are the central targets, farmers the key partners and beneficiaries. When we put material together, we screen it. At that stage, we call farmer to discuss with us, look at the material, and tell us what they need using their own criteria. Traditional varieties, they have been developed with fertilizer applied under good rainfall conditions. Simit went a completely different route. We took the varieties, we exposed thousands of them to very severe stress conditions, drought, low soil fertility. We selected the best, we brought them to farmers, and farmers told us which one they like. The team adopted the mother-baby trial system. Community seed production groups and small seed companies made sure seed from the selected varieties was available to farmers. And community-based organizations promoted the stress-tolerant varieties. When the rains are not enough and it is frequently so, then there is sometimes crop failure. That is why as the diocese we are also promoting the early maturing uh, dry land crops. Farmers from Kenya to Zimbabwe who adopted the new materials have seen yields increase between 25 and 35 percent. And just as importantly, they've had good harvests in the dry years, thus minimizing risk in their farming system. With every year of research that we do now and into the future, we can add to a farmer's fields another 100 kilogram of maize yield. That means for a farming family to have two bags of more maize to eat or to sell. Me, I get more maize and more bags, and I sell in a very high class because like this season, I earn that in bags. Today, a million hectares or more is sown with one of the 50 hybrids or open-pollinated varieties that have resulted from the program. It's not easy to make a difference to poor farmers. Uh, it's a challenge I think many researchers dream about, and to be in the middle of that dream is, is a very unique opportunity. Yeah. And one which Simit will continue to advance, as the job, while started, is not finished. We accept the King Bodwan Award with pride, on behalf of all the partners who contributed to such a great success story.